Now on WSAR's Breakfast Club, it's the Bristol Community College Update. A monthly visit with President Laura Douglas on 1480 WSAR and 95.9 FM. Sponsored by Bristol Community College. Dreams within reach. Visit bristolcc.edu. Denny Cosmo, he is the uh, Bristol Community College's director of the Joseph A. Marshall Veterans Center. Marshall Veterans Center serves as a central location for all student services and grant-related veterans activities while providing a sense of the community among uh, college student veterans. Uh, we have a dedicated VA school certifying official, Robin. She's like the first point of contact that does all the in-processing certification with the VA education benefits. We also have John, who's the academic advisor. He's also a Marine veteran to help the student veterans navigate higher education and their degree programs. Then you have me as the director and that does the social programming and adds value to their educational experience while they're at Bristol Community College. And we also have VA work study so that they can earn some additional income, gain some additional skills outside of the military as they transition into civilian careers. And, you know, we do a lot of collaborations with other student-led groups, other veteran centers at four-year schools, and we just try to create a culture and community where student veterans, military spouses, children of veterans using GI Bill benefits really thrive. How many veterans would you say you have? Because I think for a lot of us, when we think of college students, we think, you know, 18, 19-year-olds, 20-year-olds. Yeah. How many, it, Are there quite a few? Uh, there are. We're a small community college, but we do have, we're about 1% to 2% of the student body uh, okay. are military connected. So that includes spouses and children. But when you look at uniformed service members in the National Guard, active duty veterans and reservists, we're probably around 1% of 1.25% of the college body. All right. Um, but yeah, we 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 don't just serve veterans. It's it's their spouses, it's their families that are using right. that bill yeah, benefits true. as well. Uh, Denny, what are some of the things that are coming up? Some of the initiatives of Bristol uh, Joseph A. Marshall Veterans Center that in the near future. Yeah, as I mentioned earlier, we just did Water Fire. We had student veterans get together and volunteer for the event, and they collaborated with Rhode Island College Veterans Center as well as Torchbearers. November 9th uh, is the sixth annual Art of Fitness Charity Showcase, and they've chosen our Student Veterans of America chapter and Clear Path New England as some of their benefactors. So if you're interested in seeing a show, um, November 9th, uh, Art of Fitness is having a showcase for us. November 10th, we're really proud about our second annual St. James Salutes Veterans. If you go to Facebook at Bristol CC Veterans Center, you can see where to buy tickets. Last, that's completely student-led. Uh, last year, we raised about $4,000 to send our student veterans to our national conference with Student Veterans of America. So if you're an alum of Bristol Community College, we, very, uh, we really urge you to get involved with our Alumni Foundation, Alumni Association, and reach back to the student veterans that are currently there. So that's 10 November. 19 November, we're doing a Veterans History Project with the Library of Congress. We're going to be partnering with the Disabled American Veterans Chapter 7 in New Bedford to record their stories, submit them to the Library of Congress so the American people can hear the veteran experience from local New Bedford veterans. Uh, and then as soon as the New Year's over, we're going to be going to Colorado Springs for the 17th Annual Student Veterans of America National Conference. And we put our application in for Chapter of the Year, so fingers crossed, Bristol Community College can be in um, on a national platform. Mm, very awesome. Uh, Danny, what was that uh, Facebook page again? It's uh, Bristol CC Veteran Center, and it's the same handle on Instagram. Okay, and is the website the same uh, as well? Uh, if you go to bristolcc.edu slash veterans, that'll take there you, you to our landing page if you're interested in education benefits, VA work study, and kind of the paperwork process of what we offer at Bristol Community College. Yep. You can find us there. Awesome. Thank you so much, Denny. We appreciate you coming on the show today, and we hope you have a wonderful day as well. You too. Happy Veterans Day.